Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to stop your computer from locking automatically on your Windows 11 device. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu and type in settings, best match, you'll come back with settings listed right above app. Go ahead and open that up. And then on the left side, you want to select accounts. On the right side, you want to go and select sign in options. And then you want to go and scroll down underneath dynamic lock. Go ahead and left click on that. And you want to make sure that this box is unchecked where it says allow Windows to automatically lock your device when you're away. So make sure that is unchecked. So make sure it's an empty box there. And then once you're done with that, you can also go ahead and close out of here. And if you open up the search menu, type in screen saver. You want to select change screen saver. If it's set to screen saver, it might say blank, for example. You may want to consider changing it to a different screen saver on the list here. And you can also change the screen saver settings by selecting the settings button. So again, pretty straightforward on that as well. You might be having a blank screen saver. That's something else you can try. Further thing you can do as well would be to open up the search menu, type in power plan. Best match, you come back with edit power plan. Go ahead and open that up. Versus put the computer to sleep, click inside the drop down, and you can disable sleep or change the interval here. And you can do the same options as well with turning off the display. So if you just want to have your screen become blank after so much time, you can change those settings here as well. And then once you've made your selection, you will select the Save Changes button. And that's pretty much it. So as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do both able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.